What is up guys, GSM Messi here and welcome to another squad builder on FIFA 13. This one is going to be a cheaper silver team, so the ones that can't afford the likes of uh, Wallison and Michael Leite etc. They can go for these guys and they're actually really really good. I made this team on a foothead and I was expecting it to be average at best, um, but overall so good to play with and the amount of good goals I scored with it, I'm very impressed with it indeed. So yeah, like I said, under 25k, I'll put the uh, like the price at the end uh, in total. And also, I've got some new kind of thing. Like I, every time I go through the player, I will show the top three in-game stats. So if you want me to keep that, I will do. And if you want me to show the, uh, all of the in-game stats, I can gladly do that also. So starting off in goal, and just starting off, the formation is a 4-5-1. This formation is deadly on FIFA 13. Um, very good counter attacks, very good defensively. And uh, overall, the defense is so solid on this team um, that it just makes the formation look even better. <laughs> but as you may notice from my bench quickly, uh, I have got a inform Frank Ribery. Um, I'll get into it like, later, but I will be doing a review on him very soon. Thanks to a uh, subscriber of mine for letting me borrow him. So starting off in goal, we have got the big man Fabiano of Porto. Costing 1,500 coins, very cheap. Six foot six. He's really tall and he's such a good goalkeeper. Them stats overall are very nice. Uh, they're all above 74, I think. Yeah, uh, apart from the speed, that doesn't really matter in a keeper. Uh, right back, we have got Raph, uh, Rafinha. He plays in the uh, Pro League for KAA Ghent. Uh, he's very good in defence. Got quite a decent long shot as well. He hasn't scored any for me, but uh, he gets him on target at least. Uh, he is only two star skills, but the more expensive version of him would be a Cicinho from Sevilla. Costs me 1,000 coins, so he again is very cheap. Next, we have got, I think he's the second most expensive player on this team. Uh, it's Rodney. He plays in the Austrian Bundesliga for uh, Red Bull Salzburg, I believe that is. He's got 70 pace. Um, I can't remember his in-game stats, but he's got 90-plus strength, I believe. Uh, scored three goals in seven games. That's quite a good record for a centre-back, and that's mainly from his corners. 77 heading and 73 defending on top of 70 uh, pace. 6-3, he's very, very solid, and he links up well with uh, Aislan. I haven't actually used him. Uh, the person I do use, um, although I haven't got the in-game stats for the other one, so I have to use Aislan for this bit. Uh, but he's got 70 pace, 70 defending, and a 73 heading. 6-4, uh, but instead I will put uh, this guy, and this is who I do actually play. Because um, he's a lot faster. He's called Thiago uh, Kionek. And he has um, got 76 pace. He's non shiny, uh, 6 foot tall. And he has played every single game for me so far. So he basically is the starter. Um, then at finish off the defence, at left back, we have got Gilherme Santos. But that's how you say his name. Um, uh, the cheaper alternative to uh, Mike Not Mike on. Um, I forgot his name. Mine has gone black. Marcia Azevedo. That's what I'm on about. 3 star skills, 3 star weak foot. And uh, it cost me 2,400 coins. Uh, but the 451 formation is pretty cheap. It's about 400 coins. So uh, this team really don't have to worry about getting them all in formation from the off. On to the midfield, we have got Reynaldo. Um, instead of Michael Niete or Dan Lino, we've got this guy. He's four star skills, four star weak foot. Uh, he's got two goals in seven games, 1,300 coins. Plays for Adelaide in the Pro League. And um, he's quite nice to play with, actually. He's got a few assists for me. Uh, got a, a decent shot on him. And uh, his defending is quite, not defending, his um, pace is pretty good. At centre attacking mid, we've got another Adelaide player. Oh, didn't really push the formation there. Uh, it's Fernando Scanessin. Uh, I can't pronounce his name at all. He's four star skill, four star weak foot again. Uh, he's very good on FIFA 12. Uh, kind of overlooked by the like uh, the cheaper cams uh, such as Lincoln that because they're five star skills. But nonetheless, four star skills and four star weak foot. 1,200 coins and he plays at Adelaide again. Uh, he's got some nice uh, overall stats. So 82 pace, 76 dribbling, and uh, his shot is also again uh, okay. The holding midfielder of this team is going to be Serginio. Um, I did use him on FIFA 12 for a brief uh, st uh, spell. But overall, he's very solid in defence. 72 defending. And he's also got a decent shot on him as well. He has scored two goals. And they're both from outside the box, I believe. 1,500 coins. Plays for Athletic Monero in Liga do Brasil. Uh, at second camp, we have got Serginio. He's played half the games for me. Um, he's a hidden gem. As you can see in the game stats on the screen. He's got a lot of high ones. Um, he's very good to play with. 5 foot 7, he hasn't actually scored for me yet though, uh, but 83 pace and 75 dribbling, he's uh, very good to play with. But instead, uh, last couple of games I have been using this guy, Jorginho, he plays in Serie B, uh, 84 pace, 77 dribbling, and um, he's got one goal in three games, and he costs 650 coins also. The left mid is the most expensive player on this team, and that is Rafael Martinho, 92 pace, 78 dribbling, uh, 4 star weak foot, 3 star skill, 6 foot tall as well, so he's very tall. Uh, with a lot of pace. Very nice to have. Place was in the Serie B for Verona. Um, very good player. And he's also got a decent-ish um, decent shot on him. 
Uh, then at striker, we have got the best player of this team, in my opinion. That is Paul Inio. Again, plays in the Serie B for Livorno. Uh, three star skills, three star weak foot. 700 coins is absolutely still. 11 goals in uh, seven games for me. 85 pace, 70 dribbling, and uh, only 69 rated. So that is the team, guys. Uh, 4 5 1. There will be some goals after this. Uh, I'll just go through my bench if anyone is interested. We've got Alessandrini. Uh, oh, Alessandri is very good. Uh, Anan, Quintero, uh, Castenos. Uh, at Quintero, though, I will be doing a review on him very soon. Uh, then we've got Baista, Quincy Owusu Bay, Inform Ribery, uh, Aralano, Jorginho, Aislan, Paolo, Makedo, and Malapa. That is the team. So, thank you for watching the video. If you could drop a like, that'd be awesome. Um, I'm going to be bringing back a trading series. Uh, please leave a comment. I'll like put it at the beginning of the video as well. Uh, who you want me to trade to? It's going to be either, uh, either sorry, um, Zlatan Ibrahimovic or Raheem Sterling. So let me know. There's a bit of a price difference between the two of them, but let me know who you want me to trade to. Uh, or if there's someone else around that region, uh, let me know in the comments below, guys. So thank you for watching the video. Please drop a like, please subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.